Hello? Anybody there? Someone is coming. Hi there. What are you doing? Can I see the video? That is it? It is boring. The song is great but the video is just boring. I have the right solution for you. Introducing the amazing ring. It comes in different shapes and colors. Turn on your music and this thing will start to dance. What is it you wanted to ask? Well, for those of you asking the same question, you clicked on the right video. All right, let's go. These are the things that I will be going through in this video. Hello. Firstly, what you need to do is download a V player from the App Store. Once you have downloaded it, open the app. You can swipe right to choose your downloaded music to be played. To start making the audio visualizer, you want to be on this page. At the top right you can see the export button, the edit button, and the choose button. The choose button allows you to choose from many default audio visualizer designs to be used with minimal changes to be made. To add a background image, select the audio visualizer design of your choice. Click on the edit button. Click on image. Notice there is a white outline. The outline shows you which area you want to edit. The background image or the logo. Choose which area you want and click on image again on the right side and click on custom image. Then, pick image. After you have successfully picked an image, you can change other settings too. Play around with what each setting does, and find what suits you best. If you are happy with the results, you can go ahead and export the video. Since this is a default audio visualizer, not much is needed to be changed, and you are all set to export the video. To export, click on the export button. Change the setting according to your preference and finally click export. You can find the exported video in your gallery ready to be uploaded. Now before I go on to teach you how to make a custom audio visualizer, please remember to click on the subscribe and bell button down below to give me your support. Now, to make a custom audio visualizer, click on the choose button, select any design and click on duplicate. Select the duplicated one. Click on the edit button. On the left, click on final composition. Now, press and hold on the reset button and everything will be cleared. Now do the same for the other compositions. Now that it is empty, you are ready to start from scratch. Click on the plus button and add audio provider. Next. Add image. Hello. And finally add bars. First thing you need is to pick a custom image. After adding image, you can start customizing the audio visualizer. Click on bars on the left side. Then click on bars again on the right. You can click the arrow here and you can choose your preferred bar type. You can change the radius here. You can change the height here. You can customize the colors here.
You can customize many other settings such as gap, mirror, and more. Play around with the settings and find your own style. Under audio provider there are also other settings you can change to make your audio visualizer unique. You can also add particles to your audio visualizer and customize them too. That is all for this video. Now do you know how to do it? Wow! That is great! Thanks man! Leave questions in the comment section down below. Now go try for yourself and experiment with the app. I hope that this simple tutorial of how to use a V player is helpful to you guys. Do not forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more music producing videos.